Nation. It's the Home Depot SEC on CBS. It's the defending national champions against the Texas A&M Aggies. Lena. Jake Matthews moved from right tackle to left. Here's Manziel going deep again. And there's Evans again. And Fulton. Stand. Whoops. Mistake. Well, there's the answer. That's Cameron Clear. This time, no fumble when he hit his back. Got him again. Wow, Evans. Yep, got him again. Up against 6-5. Molina cuts it back, right side. Struggles. Breaks the plane. Aggie touchdown, they're up by 13. Total blitz look by AM. They did. McCarron, right side, come back to Norwood. That's good. Yeah, it's a touchdown. Beautiful back shoulder throw. Man, look again. Let's see if they come again. Pitch clicker. He's got him deep. Yes, he does. The Andrew White touchdown. Crimson Todd. Five-man rush, Manziel retreats. Look at this. He's still on his feet and heaves it deep. Oh, my gosh. Can you say magic? Ray Carson is the running back. Manziel into the end zone. Intercepted. That's hard no to leave. It's hard to believe. Cyrus Jones. Number two is DeAndrew White. He caught the touchdown pass. They go the other direction. And this is Kenny Bell flying down the sidelines. He will not be caught. Go ahead, touchdown, Crimson Tide. The top, two to the bottom. Four-man rush. Manziel deep right side. Tip. Could be intercepted. Sanseri has it. Vinny Sanseri. Who returned one for a touchdown against Vatek. Needs a block. Needs one more. Spins. He's got a touchdown. What's not in there is that interception for a touchdown. Yeah. That was some Seri for 73 yards. Here's Manziel, takes off. Oh, look at that move. Hello. Tackling air, getting a block downfield. Clock a little bit. I'm telling you, you cannot play zone against this offense. You have to come after him and take away space. Left side, timing pattern, it's caught. Walker might have stepped out of bounds. Push, push him out of bounds. Into the end zone, touchdown, Malcolm Kennedy. Well, yep. there's one possession. That's right. A perfect fourth quarter is what they need. Load up on the left side, come to the left side. Now, no, sir. That ball went, that ball came out, too. Oh, yes, my. it did. Security. That was AM's only three down. See how many they bring. Mosley sneaks up. Looks like he's coming. He is. Manziel from the end zone. Deep down the middle. Got a man. Evans. Evans with a foot race. Michael Evans. One man. Sunsay. Cannot stop him. Touchdown. He's the magic man. Big one was a 95 yarder. Hagan comes. They don't get him again. Now he lobs it deep. It's caught again. <laughs> Mike Evans again. This is Blitz. 
Left corner. Kennedy. Touchdown, Aggies. But we're going to get an onside kick. Here. Only one guy in the middle, though. They come to the right. Amari Cooper, pretty good uh, guy to have the ball in his hands. Well, and the deep man for the volunteers, Jacob Carter. Oh, he, Whoa. Uh, he took a pop as well. Snap from James Stone. Well, oh, that one's Ball's fumbled. Out. Yeah. That's recovered. Dante Fowler Jr. Driscoll again, no blitz. From the backside, Driscoll oh, yeah. hit, intercepted. And here we go down the sidelines. Devon Swafford untouched. There are no flags. Tennessee touchdown. And on top of that, Driscoll is hurt. Down for Tennessee in the game. Third and nine. Blitz. Got him. Fumble. Ball is out. Who got it? Gators got it. Peterman got protection, tipped. There's a battle for it, and it comes down for the Gators. Brian Poole, the nickelback. Tyler Murphy gets the snap. Quick uh, flip out. Good, good block by Burton. And here goes Solomon Patton flying in for a touchdown. And they are buying in. They're trying to give the coach what he can. Fumble snap by Tyler Murphy, who got Jeez, it. Jeez, I'll tell you, this is as bad as I've seen. Tennessee reacting as if they did. Yep. They did. Wow. Third down, 10. Oh, he's hit from behind. Still completes it. Fumbles it. It's oh picked up my. by Tennessee. How do you do? Cameron Sutton, number 23. Oh, it slipped out of his hands. It's picked off. Darius Cummings. Oh, he got knocked down by his own guy. And again, it's an eye formation. Joyer leads the way. Mac Brown gets a block. Scoots into the end zone. They didn't score. They overload on the right side. Nothing there. Look, Joyer, out. Yeah, nice he did. Play. Touchdown, Gators. Hunter Joyer with the block. Matt Jones with the six points. And in front for the Volunteers. Quarterback draw. That was designed. Oh, wow. Touchdown, Gators. Murphy all the way. They had called this play burn, sorry. All righty, that's okay. Here's Worley got coming. Him. Oh, he's got him, touchdown. You can see the breakdown on this Florida defense. They just do not have the experience now. Worley. Oh, it's picked off. Intercepted by Jabari Gorman. By the quarterback, swipe across their head and get ejected for hitting, targeting the quarterback to the head. This will be intercepted. Picked off by Marcus May. The freshman safety, and Worley is picked off for the second time. Favorite players to go up top with, number 82. Chris Conley is the wide man, bottom of the screen. And the man look all over. There he is to Michael Bennett. Touchdown, Georgia. What did you saw? With that graphic, here comes the blitz. Mettenberger across the middle, got a man! It's Cadron Boone of all people, and he strolls in untouched. 48-yard touchdown. Only his second catch of the season. Wide to the left side of one bottom of the screen. Across the middle, it goes intercepted. Wow. Picked off by Anthony Johnson, who dropped back into coverage. And Murray is picked off, and LSU has great, great field position. Mettenberger, no pressure. Touchdown, Cadron Boone's second of the ball game.
Here's Bennett getting in the slot, top of the screen. Play action. Murray goes deep. Got a man open. Chris Conley. Touchdown, Bulldogs. <laughs> oh, man. Cross. Mature, wonderful young man. Got him. Oh, boy, does he ever. Reggie Davis. Six seconds to go. Murray, quarterback sneak. Touchdown, Georgia. Heck of a drive. Deep left side. Over the shoulder catch. Chris Conley. How about stepping Amazing. up and timing? How about that? Because he had one of 100 yards earlier. Here's the kick. That's got plenty. Holy cow. My goodness. A career long for Marshall Morgan. Nobody's covering the guy up to the top of the screen. That's amazing. Mettenberger goes down the middle. Perfect. Landry slips the tackle. Touchdown. Georgia again discombobulated on defense. I don't think they had any idea what defense they were running on that play. Two or three examples of what might have been called. We'll Remember, Mettenberger had one. Of the LSU had one early. Both yes. sides. Ball's loose. Still, and Georgia's got it. Indeed. I think it was Connor Norman that ended up with the ball to come out and drop his defensive lineman. Nobody does. Nope. Murray. Wide open. Michael Bennett, Georgia touchdown. That looked like a blown cover. Yes. I'm tired oh. to say it. Third and 11. Near side. Three-man rush. Mettenberger deep in the middle. What a play. Wow, Jarvis Landry. Now the helmet came off. Does he have to leave for one play? It depends if the defender knocked it off. Of the drive. Follow the fullback for a touchdown for LSU. Kenny Hilliard strolls in untouched and celebrates with his teammate, J.C. Opportunity to play Georgia. Toss to Hill. Comes outside and score. And LSU has gone on top. Third and 23. Yep. Still playing soft. Green up the middle. Green with the first down. From the 25. Third and ten. Blitz up the middle. Mettenberger across the middle. Incomplete. Is there a flag? There is no. Oh my gosh. Mettenberger heaves it. That's incomplete. It'll go over on downs. Fifty five yards last week. He's going to try one from fifty seven. How about that? Man, what a weapon. Murray will throw it into the end zone. Conley, did he get it? Wow. He got it. Wow. That's a one-hander, I think. Throw it out. Back pylon. 
your guy gets it or nobody gets it, your guy got it. That's hooking in. Yeah. Oh, it hit it. Hit. It's a doink. Yeah. Here we go. Some kind of big play they've been saving anywhere. There's the play action. Worley. He's got a man wide open. The defender's shot. Wiggins. Slip. Pig. Howard. Well, there's a big, there's a start. Blitz. Into the corner. Did he get it? He did! Mark Quez North. Remember, you only have to have one foot, one toe in there. and Corey Miller. Can they make a play up front? Third and six. Here it comes. Got him! Corey. Corey Vereen. Got Picked up on one hop by Tennessee. They will stroll in. Devon Swafford, who two weeks ago picks it up on one hop and goes in for the score. At the 40. Murray will take off. Murray still up. How do you believe this? Of all the unexpected, listen, Quavon Hicks. In the backfield, along with Merritt Hall. Look at Hicks with the block. Douglas, touchdown, Bulldogs. They had two fullbacks in the game, a tight end in the game, and they tossed it wide. Nice play. Play action. Worley drills it. Got him in! A.J. Brennesel. Worley with a very efficient game today. One touchdown, no interceptions. He will hand it off. Ray John Neal, Tennessee on top. Out with a knee injury. Here's Connolly. Can he get it to his big guy? Ooh. Little swing out of the backfield. It's Douglas down the sidelines. Still going. The clock will stop as they move the chain. On Murray, it's third and goal. Eight seconds to go. Is that caught? It is. Red Tavius Wooten has caught it. Marshall Morgan for the tie. Good. Worley has the keep again if he wants it. Mm-hmm. Second and goal. First overtime. Handoff sweep. Pig Howard comes right to the five. Dives. Did he? Oh, he hit the pylon. Did he step out first? A conference among the two officials nearest the play. The ball. Oh, he lost, he the, lost ball. the ball. That, is that he coming? did. That's a touchback. Yes, it is. He lost the ball. That's going to be a touchback. After review, the runner lost possession of the ball prior to crossing the goal line. Therefore, by rule, it is a touchback. It'll be George's ball at the 25-yard line. 42 officially. And this is for a Georgia win. They have got it.
They always going to fake it. They'll get one on one. Eight men in the box right now. One on one on the outside. On first down, it's Alfred Blue getting his first action. Mettenberger drills it right side. Oh, what a catch! Jarvis Landry. They have great confidence in their he took ability. It right away from him. Yes, he did. Now both receivers. Oh, he dropped the ball. Wow. Turnover. Was it tipped out of his hand by Orr? Leon Orr recovered it. Did he get a hand on it before it happened? I think Zach is saying that it should be an incomplete pass. Does it get tipped? I couldn't tell on that one. It looked like he just dropped it. I think he was it. just coming up. Just dropped it. Yeah. Yes, he oh, did. Oh, yeah, he did. Now, Odell Beckham Jr. would like to return one. Ford has not allowed much in punt returns. Christie, fake. Goes left. Got him! My LSU was playing safe on the play, too. They were ready for it. Burton and Patton wide to the left, two other receivers wide right. LSU brings four. Murphy got him Can't. at the 21. Ahmad Fullwood, a freshman slot receiver. Trey Burton, rather. And again, it's four. Coming, they got him. No, they don't. Now they do. Jalen Mills, number 28, finally got there. I think Jordan Allen forced the play, though. Fourth and 27. Too far to kick a field goal. Murphy hit from behind. That is a fumble. Scramble. It's a moot point, really. The ball was going to go over at any rate. Kendall Beckwith hit Murphy. And he sold his team. The toughest team was going to win. And they were the tougher team. Now, this is the 37th carry on the ground. Flag thrown on Ronald Powell, number seven. And there's a player down between the 20 and 25. Getting a little chippy out there. Could be anybody, you know, right? At this stage. <laughs> Uh, here's a mocking in the end zone with the game. Well, the play with a dead ball, personal foul, number seven of the defense. Half the distance to the goal, automatic first down. That's on Ronald Powell, number seven. Timeout, Florida, for second timeout of the half. Florida takes timeout. LSU leads by 11. One on one. Maybe nobody one on one. Auburn brings five, and this is Evans circling inside. Looking for a block, touchdown, A&M. Marshall pressure, touch it, runs. Man. Touchdown, Auburn, my gracious. Johnny Manziel playing for both teams here today. Did that not? Passes for 279 yards against the Crimson Tide. That's a school record. That one's dropped. Oh, was that intercepted? Oh, it, it no, was. No, it intercepted. Was. I think Ryan Smith got the interception. How about the interceptions leads the team in that category? Now look at that throw. My goodness, watch yep. it. Watch out. Mike Evans, touchdown A&M. 64 yards. Feel good. We feel we can score just like they are. Marshall keeps this oh, one and comes out. It. Aggies have got it. Stephen Jenkins, number eight. The season on the road, their last two at LSU and at Missouri. Manziel. Amazing. Just amazing. Uh -oh. <laughs> is there it picked off? Yes, yes, it, it is. is. Ryan White, number 19. That's what I said. Oh. Delayed rush. Marshall in the end zone. Caught touchdown. Quan Bray, number four.
I'll tell you, that's a big, big time throw by Nick Marshall here. Just rush four. Four receivers out. Manzo pulls up, fires it wide open. It's Evans. Goes down, he gets a block. Dives. Touchdown. Travis Lambhart with the block. Inside move. Sammy Coates. He's open. He's gone. It's a touchdown, Auburn. Mike Sherman offered at uh, College Station. Manziel. He's got it. Who else? Jeez. Mike Evans. Not only that, they're going to call pass interference, and it didn't make any difference. Artis Payne has gained 80% between the hashes. On the right, it's Marshall. Touchdown, Auburn. Woo. What a drive. A little bit of everything. Auburn needs to slow down. AM wants to stop the clock now. Mason again. That's going to be a first down. The ball carrier broke the plane of the goal line by rule. Touchdown. Throw it to him. Bottom of the screen. They're playing way off of it. Chris Davis. They rush five. Manziel. That'll do it. Wow. What a game for that front four for Auburn. What a win for Gus Manziel. And you saw the remainder of the offensive lineup out of the spread. McCarron goes the opposite side to Cooper. Same play. Different result. Jeez. He is flying. There are no flags this time. Touchdown. 54 yards. From the 22-yard line. McCarron deep down the middle. Got a man wide open. Nobody Kevin covered. Norwood. Touchdown. Another third and four earlier in the quarter. Worley takes off on him. Intercepted. Picked off by Dion Blue. That thing was quacking as it came into his arms. Blue with a convoy. And Worley is there to knock him down. I think it might be Worley's thumb on this throw. Good one. Drake. Spin. Did he lose control he before he, he crossed? I he think did. he did. And that is the indication it will be Tennessee ball. He fumbled against Kentucky. Four-man rush. Intercepted. Picked off by Landon Collins, the true freshman. One man out in front. That's Pagan. Provides the block on Worley. Collins. 88-yard touchdown interception. David Cutcliffe, Coach Peyton at Tennessee. Peyton Manning and Eli Manning at Ole Miss. Here's McCarron again, no pressure. Gets a block from Vogler to give him time to go deep. And there's a one-on-one. -on -one. Oh, Kevin Norwood. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Call me AJ. <laughs> we've got AJ Johnson and AJ McCarron, and now we've got Yeldon for TJ. a touchdown. TJ. TJ, yes. <laughs> yards, two games, 391 yards. Murphy goes deep. Got a man wide open. It's Quentin Dunbar, and there is a foot race. That's Patton down to help out, and it allows Mauger to come up. You're a lip reader. You know exactly how he expressed himself. Here's the field goal attempt. It is wide right.
Francisco Velez, who came on to replace Austin Harden at LSU. So an 82-yard pass completion leads to not percent yield on third down. Murray across the oh, middle. Oh, man. Oh, man. Touchdown, Georgia. I mean, it, it devastated the Georgia offense. First down, 10. Douglas, nice cut at the line of scrimmage. Better. Oh, he bowls his way. Whoa. That'll get them on their feet. Man. I mean, you're looking at two guys. J.J. Green, the play before. And now Douglas. Two guys that never thought they'd see the field this year. And both making an impact runs right over Cody Riggs. One of the 16 finalists for the William B. Campbell Trophy. That's an $18,000 scholarship already. And if he wins, it's 25. That uh, will be awarded by the National what Football call. Foundation. What a call Rowe. they had set up, too. Lynch. They calling it a lateral? It appears they so. They do. They're calling it a lateral. This could be the break that Florida needed to get back in this game. They had it set up for a big, big throwback screen. So After review, the ruling on the field is confirmed. Second and one. Brown again gets around the corner. Touchdown, Gators. Oh, they had him, and they get it to Patton about the time the tackle is made. And Patton... Horse collar. Yes, indeed. This play could have lost 15 yards. It's going to end up being a 15-yard gain. Josh Harvey Clemens, I think, is the end, and we got more flags going. Uh, that's at least three. Coaches out there trying to separate the players. I mean, this could have been a 15-yard loss, and it's going to end up being a 15-yard gain. During the play, we have a live ball, personal foul, horse collar, number 25 in the defense. That penalty will be enforced 15 yards, automatic first down. Following the play, we have unsportsmanlike conduct, number 59 white, unsportsmanlike conduct, number 52 white. Dead ball, unsportsmanlike conduct, number 72, blue. Unsportsmanlike conduct, 74, blue. First down. So four more players have offsetting personal dead ball fouls who won more, and they're out of the football game. Now, Murray and the Georgia offense, they've run five plays in this quarter. Watch out. Safety. Lucky held on to it. Corner cat. That is the quarterback's job. And Luches Purifoy, who was benched, makes a play. He was telling his guys, we got to finish this game. It's not going to be easy. Murphy again at the goal line. Dives in. Touchdown, Florida. Takes the snap. Here comes the blitz right across the middle. Got it. Clay Burton for two. That is his first catch of the season. We'll snap it back. Murphy has three receivers top of the screen. Blitz coming again. They got him. Corey Moore unimpeded. Well, we said 
that Todd Grantham was rolling. Blitz after blitz after blitz. Right side. Now this is McGowan. He goes back to the right side. Blitz again. Murray rolls out, fires it. McGowan leading. Got a first down. Red McGowan, high school point guard, walk on. Native Calhoun, remember big Chris Durham went to camp from the same area. And McGowan makes the play. Made the play in 2011 and made the play again right there to get another first down. Arthur Lynch in motion, now goes back to the right. It's Gurley again. No. Damian Jacobs has uh, a flag. Would down. there be a holding call on the play? That's the question. If it's against Florida, it's the ball game. Personal foul, number 55 defense, illegal hands to the face. Half the distance to the goal, automatic first down. Ball game. And it was on David Andrews. A hand to the face mask inside. Very clearly, we saw it in the replay up here already. We've already seen it once. 55 on 61. Watch his hand go to the face mask and bend him straight back. You can see it right there. Well, a Florida loss would all but uh, erase their hopes. The Georgia win keeps it alive. And there's Leon Orr getting into a chest bumping match again. And a flag thrown. John Theus goes over and mockingly yeah, just, does the Gator Just jump. remember that if you're thrown out twice, if you're one of those guys that gets two of them, you could be suspended for the next game, and Mark Rick has got to get his starters off that field. All of a sudden, it's a hanky party. Yes. Bennett. And just remember, if it's Gurley, he's already had one. We have multiple unsportsmanlike fouls after the play. Unsportsmanlike conduct number three white. Unsportsman conduct number 11 white. Unsportsman conduct number 68 white. Also, unsportsmanlike conduct on blue, what number? 49. Those fouls offset at the dead ball spot, second down. Well, so it's Gurley, Murray, and Burnett for Georgia, and Darren Kitchens. Well, Todd Gurley actually throws a kind of a punch to the face mask at the end of this play right there. Ah, eh, shove to the face mask. Punch might be overdoing it a bit. Yep. There's one flag. Now they're pulling, Artie Lynch is pulling Burnett back away from things. I'll tell you, on this drive, Aaron Murray, three for three with the pressure on. Behind Mettenberger, it's Copeland. He scores on every... He oh, fumbled, he fumbled it. it! He fumbled it! And Landon Collins comes up with it. Turnover. Alabama football. To the left, Cadron Boone. Oh, no! Oh, no! Another one. Mettenberger was going to change the play, and Porter snapped it. For O.J. Howard is split to the right side. They look for Howard. Oh, They've got him. One man to beat. He can't get him. Touchdown, Alabama. Something Alabama does not show a lot. What's coming? McCarron deep in the end zone. Got it. Touchdown, Kevin Norwood. And he appears to be hurt. Mettenberger lobs it. Caught. Touchdown, Trav Traven Durrell. That's his sixth catch of the year. It's one of those bunch routes that the NFL coaches bring with them. Fake. They do fake it. They've got it. First down after the 47-yard line, Jarek Williams. 
number 20. Oh, good, good snap anticipation. Yeldon gets a block in the corner. Touchdown, Crimson Tide. What a drive. Can LSU force a tournament? Play action, McCarran. Off his back foot, Fowler. Touchdown, Alabama. Melvin Ray. You got Bray and Ray out there. And here we go. Corey Grant. Touchdown, Auburn. For the first time in a couple of weeks. Number 31. High ankle sprain for him. Here's Gurley again. Touchdown, Georgia. But he's rolling them faster and faster. Marshall again. Marshall's touchdown for the Auburn Tigers. Away in 82. Chuck Long of Iowa in 85. Marshall. Not much doing. Oh, no, my goodness. From 36. Blocked. How about that? Blocked. The Google attempt is blocked. Is out of this game with a foot injury. First and ten. From the backside, intercepted. Picked off by Ryan Smith. Is it D Ford again? Number 30 that came in and got the pressure. Most immeasurably different than everybody else. Cam in the power. Nick Marshall in the space and touchdown. Nice ball. Wow. Just pull the guard around. Hand the ball off. This was a call play. Let's see if they will give the ball to number three here now. Bennett is back in. Good news for Georgia. Looks like this was a design play. Yes, it was. And Murray in for the touchdown. Well, they ran the draw, but they ran the draw with the quarterback. Beautiful block by Gurley on the play. And the opening of the third, and they cut the margin to 27-17. Marshall going for all of it. He's got Ricardo Lewis. It's five on five. And the guy in the blue beat the guy in the white. Time to go third quarter. This is Corey Grant in motion. They take it. Look at Porsche's block. Look at Marshall's touchdown. Wow, the fullback. He just drove Ramique Wilson into the end zone. Couple from the outside. They both come. Murray. Into the end zone, caught, touchdown. Grantavius Wooten. How about that throw? You can't cover it any better than that. And Murray. Third and three. That's Ricardo Lewis. Oh, oh my tackled goodness. each other. Play action. No, Murray. Nobody covered. Wide open. It's Arthur Lynch who scoops in. Touchdown, Georgia. First busted assignment of the day for Auburn. Blitz. Marshall chased. Got him from behind. Ramik Wilson. Fourth down. Three times in a row. Todd Grantham brought the house. Murray with time. Now no time. Did he get in? Yes, he did. Yes, he did. <laughs> Got to look to see if his knee went down, though. It's close. Get a sack. Here they come. Marshall. They got him by the end. He's down. The clock's still running. 
They did. Same defense, though. Three-man rush. Let's it go. leading by five. Pressure. Murray up. Got a man, Mantavius Wooten. Down at the 25. Eight seconds to go. Wooten and Conley near side. Michael Bennett is in the slot. Murray chased out of the pocket. Hit as he lets it go. Game over. Auburn wins. Season 11 of 12. This is from 44. McCarron the holder. Didn't That's going to go left. Fourth and three. Mandel averaging 47.3. Chris Davis has a punt return. Oh, it's bumping. Uh, tipped. How about that? Davis hops up. My goodness, he dropped the ball. Marshall, big hole. Collins chases in and can't catch him. And Nick Marshall has scored the first touchdown of the ball game. 45 yards. Number four is the deep back. That's Boatler in motion. Second and goal. Play action. McCarron lobs it. Caught. Fowler. Touchdown. That's Jalston Fowler's seventh catch of the season. It was, uh, we had a chance to chat. Here's the play. Left side, Mason. Commissioner Mike, out. Oh, is it down or out? It's going to be close. Sure is. Uh, yes. Yeah, Landon Collins recovers the fumble. First down 10 at the 20 in a tie game blitz. Up the middle, good pickup by Yeldon. That's caught, touchdown. Kevin Norwood, Mr. Reliable. 
is on the field for the first time. He's a speedster number seven. They run the reverse with Amari Cooper. O.J. Howard with a huge block. And Cooper wow. diving that for the end zone. Did he get in? They're calling it a touchdown for the ball. Watch his left hand go out of bounds and touch the ground. Where's the football? Ooh. It's going to be, if it's not a touchdown, it's going to be inches short. First and goal. Yeldon is the running back. Vogler will lead the way. Yeldon. Touchdown, Alabama. You know, just mash it up there. Trust your offensive line. First down. Breaks a tackle. Breaks another. Caught from behind by Jonathan Allen, number 93. Cameron Artis Payne seeing action. Here's Marshall. Directs his blockers. That should be a touchdown. It is. Start out with a run. Break some tackles. And that time did the ball get past. He puts it into his right hand. All you got to do is break the plane. Come on. I think it's a touchdown. After review, the runner jumped out of bounds at the two-yard line. The ball crossed at the one. Therefore, it'll be placed at the one. we will be first and goal. He dismukes. They feed it to Trey Mason. Touchdown. Five, third quarter. Coach to the top up there. Marshall drills it. Uzuma. Uzuma. Touchdown, Auburn. They love the tight ends. Number 18 and 81. McCarran deep right side. Man open. Amari Cooper. Wow. For Cade Foster, a senior out of South Lake, suburb of Dallas Fort Worth. Oh boy. Little things turn into huge things. Play action, McCarran. How about this decision? Going deep. Amari Cooper is there. Has it loose down the right side. There are no flags, and that is a 99-yard touchdown. McCarran Cooper, Alabama leads. And despite the multitude of mistakes, they have a seven-point lead and force the punt. And it's taken by Christian Jones. He finally gets a chance to return one. And he's bumped out of bounds by the putter, Stephen Clark. Maza snaps it. A.J. McCarron holds it. Cade Foster kicks it, and it's going to be wide left. It's blocked. It's blocked. Dereezy Robinson blocked it. Ryan Smith picks it up, and the nightmare continues for Cade Foster. And there's a late hit. There's going to be a 15-yard penalty on top of all this as well. At the 40. Marshall keeps it, tries to get around the edge, tips it out. It's caught by Sammy Coates. Strolls in. Touchdown. Open. I'm a defender on that one. He thought for sure Marshall was keeping it. Cody Parkey, we are tied. There's that play. The triple option play working again. Here comes Alabama's Hail Mary. Yeah, no, they're no, not. It. They yeah, are. Yeah. Did he get out of bounds? He did. Two, one, hits. It's pretty close, but you, if they put if they put one second on, obviously they'll get one Hail Mary throw to the end zone. And if that clock is official. It is. They're going to give them one more chance, aren't they? And uh, we await the ruling. Here's Matt Austin. After review, the runner's foot touched out of bounds at the 39-yard line with one second on the clock. The clock will be reset to one second. It'll be first and ten. They're going to try a field goal? It's Adrian Griffin. 
Griffith, who is one for two tonight. Cody, yes, career, not tonight. 56 yards. Griffith. Adam Griffith, a redshirt freshman from Calhoun, Georgia. This is the third field goal he's attempted in his career. 56 yards for the win, but first. Officially made it 57 yards. Remember, a block kick can go the other way, too. He's got to be careful and get it up. On the way. No, returned by Chris Davis. Davis goes left. Davis gets a block. Davis has another block. Chris Davis. No flags. Touchdown, Auburn. An answered prayer. Welcome you to the SEC Championship presented by Dr. Pepper. We are inside the Georgia Dome in downtown Atlanta, and we have black and gold, and we've got blue and orange. We have Tiger fans, and we have Tiger fans. Welcome to the SEC Championship presented by Dr. Pepper, the 11-1 Missouri Tigers against the 11-1 Auburn Tigers. Little trickeration. Marshall goes deep. Got a man. Caught Sammy Coates. Each of those receivers become a factor. And Franklin will throw. Here comes the rush from Lawson into the end zone. Is that caught? Yes, it is. Doriel Green Beckham, 28 the, yards. The height of those receivers. When after it was all said and done, LSU with two losses went from seventh to second. Here's Sammy Coates. Downfield blocking. Coates at the 30. At the 20. Second down and nine. Grant is the running back. Marshall strolls in untouched. He had a 214-yard rushing game. Early onside kick. Onside kick. I think it went the distance. Now I think Auburn's got it. Yes. Or fakes, exactly. Here's Parkey. It's sailing right. He did not make it at the 25. Empty backfield. Franklin looks deep. There you go. Picked off. And Jay Prosh again, the fullback in motion. Marshall, quarterback draw. Nothing there. Another fumble. Picked up. E.J. Gaines, touchdown, Missouri. It was Cody Ely again. Tackle the guy. First and goal. Mason striving to the end zone and getting across. What a drive. What a drive. Ex-old high school coach now, isn't he? Just got a raise. Here's Mason again. He's on the loose. There's one man who can beat him. And that man does. It's Matt White. I was on the triple option from shotgun. Up the middle, another Trey Mason touchdown. They have been unstoppable. 28-20. 25 seconds to go. Deep. He's got him open. Doriel Green. Beckham. Missouri touchdown. Do. 
Jaleel Clark is now on the field, top of the screen. Franklin, no pressure. Uh -oh, wide open. There you are, touchdown Missouri. What a play call. They faked the wide receiver screen and slipped him out into the backfield. There's Corey Grant. Marshall, here we go. Race to the corner. He's knocked out of bounds at the one. You knew it was coming. It's time with the quarterback. And the hurry up. Mason is back in. Touchdown, Corey Grant. Play. 18-yard gain. Same play. Cameron Artis Payne. College in Kansas. One year there, six and four record. Here's Josie. Big hole. Josie's in a foot race. Look at this. Henry Josie. Yeah, and, and Ryan White didn't know what angle oh, to take. It. Oh no. What the diagnosis is. Marcus Murphy is in, comes wide right. Quarterback First draw. goal. There yeah. you are. Franklin. Touchdown, Missouri. Empty backfield on first down. It's almost guaranteed. Tackles eligible. Quarterback draw. He's got it. James Franklin follows McG Mason's to the left. My money's on Marshall. Fourth and goal. No, nope, should have called Mason. I don't know if he made it. He did not. It's oh, close. Now they signal. Yes, he did. Now they signal. Mason, of course. Mason, of course. Here comes the Gatorade bath. A splash for the celebration. How about Gus Miles on two SEC championships as offensive coordinator in 2010? 56 points. Tonight, 59 points. What a marvelous year. Long, long night begins for the Auburn Tigers as they await results from Florida State and from Ohio State. For Gary Danielson and Tracy Wilson, I'm Vern Lundquist saying so long from the Georgia Dome, the final 59-42. The Jeep Post Game Show is up next after these messages and a word from your local station.